Hi, I'm Kristen Keo in the 10 News Pinpoint Weather Center. We are tracking Hurricane Patricia, the strongest hurricane ever recorded by the National Hurricane Center. And we're looking at our sky cams that we have on Puerto Vallarta right now. Patricia, 85 miles off the coast, going to make landfall this afternoon. And she's going to affect the entire region from Acapulco up to Mazatlan. And we're talking 200 mile per hour wind speeds, a category five hurricane. But I want to show you something and give you an idea of how significant Patricia is. We have the hurricane wind scale that is used to categorize these hurricanes. So a five is the most significant. That is a major hurricane. And it's categorized by 157 mile per hour or higher winds. So when you think 200 mile per hour winds for Patricia, if a category six existed, we would be calling her a category six. And in fact, I think that after Patricia, we might be establishing a category six in case this ever happens again. So a very intense storm. And in fact, the pressure dropping that tells us that it is becoming even more intense as it approaches land and we're hoping to see these wind speeds drop but they're just not we are expecting it to drop to about 150 miles per hour but still that makes it a category five as it hits the land by tomorrow morning we're expecting it to weaken to a tropical storm with 70 mile per hour winds and then moving up towards texas as a tropical depression with 25 mile per hour winds here's a closer look at the eye you can see see how close it is bearing in on the coast there and I'll zoom out here and show you the path up to Texas. So in the Dallas area, they have a cold front there already bringing rain. It's going to just feed off of this. So deadly flooding coming not only to Mexico, but then to Texas. Angelica Campos is coming in to take over. She'll have more updates for you.